I've been ordering a bunch of toys off the internet and this is one of them just came today uh, obviously from China and so let's open it up and see what we got exciting these are just little toys I ordered I don't know which one it is I think I ordered like seven different things so it could be one of several different ones. I didn't really check on it. The delivery guy just showed up and I just peeled the outer, whatever it is, FedEx wrap or whatever it was off the outside of it. So what do we got? Bubble wrap. And still have no idea. No instructions. Bubble wrap. Bubble wrap. Bubble wrap, more bubble wrap, and ooh, 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 kind of looks a little mangled, but it's a one of these floating thingies that is supposed to be, that's supposed to spin, float and spin when it gets sunlight on it. So, I guess we will have to, I wonder if this light is enough power to do it. Nope. We're going to have to go take this outside and get some serious light on it and see what it does. But let's look at the close ups. Uh, it's an acrylic stand, pretty heavy duty, nice screws, heavy duty magnets here, really strong magnets. This turns out to be a really strong magnet, also. There's magnets in here and here, and here and here, and yeah, that's about it. Uh, not badly done. Okay, so that's the acrylic stand with magnets. This is the rotor. These are magnets down here. Inside here, on the original drawing on the internet, you could this had a clear end. You could see inside of it. It had coils. So the um, whatever electronics and coils are inside here and more magnets on this end and I don't know if you can tell but right there that's the end of a ballpoint pen <laughs> so that's what they're using as a ball bearing uh, kinda cute okay but uh, yeah clever idea so we're outside it's not running this is a solar water pump I have you can tell it's running the uh, sky is gray but still um, yeah, this is obviously, if it works, it's obviously going to require a lot more sunlight than most average solar things. It's uh, noontime, there's some high thin clouds. This morning under heavier clouds it wouldn't spin at all. Indoors under my brightest lights it won't spin, so I was hoping to put it on my desk and, you know, have it spin slowly under the indoor lighting, but it won't do that at all. So a little disappointing. Uh, I'm not sure why you'd have this thing just to have it operate under the brightest sunlight. Uh, what else? Uh, oh, the safety wire here is here because when the light changes, this thing will start bouncing around. I'll put some uh, video in here. I've got some video of it. It'll bounce around until it jumps out of the cradle. So the wire is here to prevent that. Here it's doing its oscillating thing. The cloud just went over. And you can hear it banging against the wire now and again. Yeah, so overall, uh, a little disappointing, but, you know, not terrible, not great. Okay, well that was it for my solar spinner experiment. I hope you found this useful and interesting in your online ordering experimentation.